Okay, this video is not only for all those who love collecting Avon bottles, but for all those of you who love the antique cars. These are all men's cologne, and they're all the Avon bottles. I really like that one really bad. <laughs> I don't know, between the red one and the tan, well, the grayish one here. These are really cool. All right, let's start with this one here. You can see it's kind of a sporty little jeepy thing. The whole engine's in the back. And that's actually the cover. Take it all out. Nice Avon bottle. All right. It says Avon right here in the front. Let me see if I can get it to show you right. Do, 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 do. Ah, can't see it so good. Let me see if it says it anywhere else for you. It's not, not so clear. I can't get it to show you right. Uh, anyhow, the license plate in the front says Avon. Gotta fill it up in order to see it good, I guess. It's kind of like this one here. This one you can really see because the whole thing's empty and it's grayish. A little harder to see right there on the blue. But right there it says Avon. It's like this license plate is Avon. That license plate is Avon. They put Avon for the license plate. All right, but look at this one. Isn't it cool? And look at this. Tires to open it up for the cover. <laughs> so cool, isn't it? All right. And this one is Avon for men. Sterling 6 Tribute. Aftershave lotion. Ooh. Look at that. Nice to see the label still on it, huh? Made in New York. That is so cool. All right. Nice. Love the idea of the tires in the back. That was cool. All right. What a sporty one, huh? All right. Now look at this little green one here. This one even has the old luggage in the back with the straps on it. You see that a lot in the Model T's. All right. And this one again is Straight 8. Wild Country. Ooh. Avon for men. Straight eight wild country. All right. And it's nice, of course, to see the label all there. All right. And it does say Avon in the front. Get the glare of the light to help you out so you can see. There you go. Avon. The beautiful lights there. So cool. Love it. It's got a little dust right there. Beautiful, beautiful vehicle. Now look at this one. Very sporty. And again, they put a tire strapped onto the back for your cover. And there you go. Avon Blend Aftershave. Avon Blend number seven. Okay. There's no more in it. Hmm. Yeah, yeah, way underneath here. That's where it says Avon. Well, I can't get the lighting. That's red. It's kind of hard to see that one like the blue is. There's Avon. There you go. Avon. Well, you know because the label was Avon still on it. All right, look at that. Isn't that cool? So neat. All right, here's a sporty little one. Now this one here, the cover is this piece here. This one's not as old. But this is Wild Country. The label is still on it, which is always good. There in the back. See the Avon right there? Cool. 
cool one. All blue. Kind of neat. Now this one still has cologne in it. Still, it's like a greenish, maybe yellow. Okay, it's got a number four on it. The rest of the cap, which probably was a tire, is not there. But this one's a racing car. All right. Still has the cologne. It's funny how the cologne still smells really super strong, too. Doesn't seem to matter how old it is. <laughs> it still has the smell. All right, I believe he's going to be a blue car when he's empty. It looks that way, huh? But with the aftershave still in it, it's kind of a greenish look. So I hope you've enjoyed my bringing these all to you. Be sure to sub me. Join me as a friend. Because we do have some more Avon bottles if you're an Avon collector. These are cool. All part of an auction. There was other stuff on top. People didn't see there was Avon bottles underneath. So, it was a good $2 fine. Alright, bye-bye now. Alright, here we are bringing you some more of the old Avon bottles. This one here even has its box. And it's still filled. Okay, Island Lime. And you can see it's an Avon bottle. And it does smell like a lime, so it's probably why it's still all there. <laughs> it's it's not a a romantic kind of smell for a lady, that's for sure. Okay, then we have this one here. Look how beautiful that cover is. I love it. Beautiful cover. Oops, and you have to look. It just says, uh, forgettable. Unforgettable Avon Cologne. Unforgettable. Very nice one. Elegant cover. I love it. Okay, and then we have Breathless. That's Avon. Put it this way here and it won't be upside down. How do you like that? Very nice. Breathless. Kind of cute. I like that bottle. Different design. And we have this one here. Very funny. Funny looking. Avon 116. That's all it has underneath. Kind of cool one. All the twists. It's all about twists. Easy to handle. Well, that's kind of cute. Now, this one here is very special. Begin with in the old days, instead of just plain bottles and stuff, uh, to buy perfume was definitely a luxury. Uh, so, not only did the perfume have to meet the standard of beautiful smell, but so did the look of the container. So this belt is beautiful. Okay, and this one is called Crystal Song Timeless Ultra Cologne. And they still got the Timeless, but this one was Timeless Ultra. It's just a nice, elegant, kind of in a ruby kind of glass. It's just a beautiful, beautiful smell. I love this one. You know, it's elegant, not overpowering because a lot of people with their allergies and stuff like that, you don't want to wear something that's overpowering and go out in crowds and stuff because that can be a lot for people with allergies. But it's such a beautiful, nice, mellow kind of smell. It really smells good. Alright, I hope you've enjoyed my bringing these to you. Be sure to sub me, join me as a friend. We'll bring you whatever else we find at the auction. This is all auction finds. 
had a box full of Avon bottles. So that was a good auction find. All right, stay tuned for more. Bye bye. Okay, here we are today with some more Avon bottles. And these are kind of cute. I mean, look at that. The tiny, tiny little antique cars. Look at that. And this one is Field Flower Cologne. Cool. That's just... Look at the wheels and everything. Isn't that cool? Love it. It's just so cute. And this one here, of course, the pumpkin. <clears throat> Beautiful. Four leaf clover on the wheels. Heart for the door. That cute. Wow, look at the design of the cap. Really nice. And you can see right there it says Avon. Isn't that cool? It's beautiful. Okay, and then of course we have a pineapple. Still has, and it says Avon underneath. Right there. Look at that. Look at the design of the glass. Isn't that cool? It's like a cross in the middle of each. Look at the cap. So neat. Don't know what kind of perfume. It smelled good. Okay, and then of course the old holiday one. Christmas boot. It has Christmas Christmas surprise. Hmm. All right. This one's rather popular. You see a lot of that one. Now this was one of the old hot dogs. Of course he lost his head. Poor hot dog. And he was caught lion. Cologne. Caught a lion cologne. Okay. Well, it's still there, but he was one of the little hot dogs. But the cap, the head is missing, just like this birdie's missing. And this was beautiful blue bird. Bird of happiness. Ah, bird of happiness. Okay, was so happy he lost his head. And look at this one, hippo. A hippo one. So cute. And the hippo is baby hippo. Sweet, honest cologne. Oh, wow, that's a good one too. And you know what's really nice? Is I don't know the age of some of these, but they've kept their smells. Out of all of these years, when you walk in my house and that's all you can smell is the Avon perfume all over the place because I've had quite a few videos from the auction out of these because it was a box full of Avon bottles and a lot of them still had their cologne in it. So that was really cool. All right, hope you've enjoyed my bringing you some of these. I mean, I really like the little vehicles here, the pumpkin and the old stagecoach, but boy, that pineapple is awful pretty. All right. So for all you Avon collectors, I hope you've enjoyed this video. Stay tuned for more, so be sure to sub me. All right, bye-bye. Okay, here we are with some old Avon bottles. We have three aftershave and one cologne. All right, I know, you already guessed which one was the cologne. <laughs> the rat and the cheese, right? <laughs> all right, you're absolutely right. <laughs> Okay, there's the mouse, and there's the cheese. <laughs> okay, and this one is 
Avon Field Flower Cologne. All right. And it actually does smell good. It does not smell cheesy. It just smells good. And my granddaughter says, I want the mouse, I want the mouse. <laughs> it's still full. All right. So, okay. Let's go on <laughs> to show you some of the aftershaves. Okay, first we have this Liberty. <clears throat> it says 1913. 1913. Is it an F or a P? F. All right. It says Liberty. It's the Indian Nickel. Okay. Behind here it says the Five Cents. United States of America. Wow, I wouldn't think they'd be able to do that. Put it on the Avon bottle. But I guess back then there wasn't so many rules or something. Alright. And this one is... Avon Wild Country aftershave. All right. Hmm. Wild Country. Cool. All right. Now this one here, I think, is supposed to represent a cannon. Nope. Isn't this funny to have this for the cover? Just turn it. It keeps going. To take it off. <laughs> and this one is Avon's Deep Woods Aftershave. Alright, this one's empty though. So the Deep Woods really worked out for someone. <laughs> Cheesy maybe not. <laughs> and of course the nickel went real fast too. Okay, now this one is the most unique one out of this collection. Because you got the eagle and you got the globe. But look at this. I can't imagine them actually selling this and going through the, the mailing process and everything because it has a thermometer on it. Look at that. It actually has a real thermometer. It smells pretty good. I didn't care so much for it, but my granddaughter really liked it. Avon's Leather Aftershave. Look at that. Lavender Change, Blue Fair. Pink rain. Okay. Isn't that cool? The whole thing. But to have a thermometer, you know, a working thermometer, still working, go through the mail. Ooh. And as you can see, underneath, let me see. Right there is Avon. Neat bottle. Look at that. Beautifully designed. Really cool. But wow. I don't know. To have an Avon bottle. Anybody know what year this is? By all means, let me know. Because this one's really, really interesting. I'd like to know when they would make it that would actually have a thermometer and everything on it. A working thermometer. To have that right on an Avon bottle, I just think that that's unreal. You know, I understand the cheese and all the other stuff, but to have a thermometer on an Avon bottle, and it says right there, Avon. Avon leather. Cool. All right. Well, I hope you've enjoyed my bringing you this collection of old Avon bottles. There's some people who enjoy collecting the old Avon bottles, so I'm sure this will be a pleasure for them to see. All right. Bye-bye now. Okay, here we have another Avon bottle, and this is an anniversary bottle. I also have the box. There we go. It says 1976 anniversary keepsake, and it's actually the um, 90th anniversary because in the back you get to see all that stuff. It tells you all about David McConey, who founded the California Perfume Company in 1886. 
So where this is 1976, it's 90 years. Okay. So let me see. Scoot down so you can read the whole story. Just put the video on pause. I want to read all about the Avon man that started this company. Well, it's not the one who started this company. I guess it's the one who done this perfume. Because the company actually started in 1919. No, 1939. Huh. Cool. But this actually has phew, it's quite the smell, too. So look at this bottle. Isn't that beautiful? It's got a beautiful top. Very elegant. Look at that. And what's really nice, I mean, it, it's got some dust on it, is look at this in the back. Let me see how I can get it to, to show you. Oh, I got it upside down. Maybe I gotta show it the right way, huh? Okay, it says Avon 90th Anniversary. Perfume. Look at that. And it's got some real, I mean, after all this time, this still smells, I don't even have to open it. <laughs> I can smell it. You know what? It smells good. <laughs> it really does. Isn't that beautiful? I mean, look at that. Still has everything on it beautifully. That was for somebody who was collecting Avon bottles. So there you go. 90th anniversary of the Avon. Hope you've enjoyed my bringing this to you. This made a good auction find. Be sure to sub me. Join me as a friend. And we'll bring you some more. All right. Bye-bye now. All right. This is an old Avon bottle. I put some blue food coloring only because it should be... I mean, it's got a fish, you know? And in the back, it has uh, the weeds and the fish going through and stuff. Beautiful. Beautiful design bottle. I don't know what was in it. See, you can see all the beads and stuff. And underneath it says Avon. Oops, upside down here. It says Avon and then there's an S. Gee, I don't know if you can see that. Probably not. There you go, Avon. And it's got, oh, it's a three. Avon 3. All right. But there's a beautiful little story behind this bottle. <clears throat> now, this bottle was in a box with a bunch of stuff for men. And I had come late to the auction and stuff. So I just glanced in the bottle. I mean, in the box and stuff. I can see I thought it was just a vase because the cap was not on with it. So, I, uh, I'm looking at it, and it's like, I don't want the rest of the content, so I'm not bidding on it. So, one of the men, you know, he was the highest bid for the stuff that was on the table, so he had a choice of what he wanted to take. So, he took three, uh, three boxes and stuff, and they're just piling it all on top of each other. I go, oh, no, don't do that. I said, there's a beautiful vase in there. And the man that was buying it, he looked at me and he says, well, I don't care about the vase. I says, well, if you don't care about the vase, be a sweetheart and give it to me. So the man just took his stuff and he's taking it out to his vehicle and everything. And so the auction, of course, continues. And I ended up, I bid in on a box and stuff. So I'm going to take it out to my car and stuff. And I go out the door and there he was right there. He came with the bottle and he gave it to me. 
He says, you know, it wasn't a vase. It actually even had a cover. And I looked at him. I says, oh, my God. I says, you are a sweetheart. And, of course, I thanked him and everything. So, you see, it's, it's communication. It's socializing. So, going to an auction has a lot of good purposes. But I thought this was a beautiful piece. And I got it for free. <laughs> All right. So free is always good. All right. Bye-bye now. Okay. Today we have a wonderful collection of some old Avon cologne bottles. Now, most of these, I think all of them, still have some cologne in them. Some are pretty full. But uh, they're rather interesting. I got these at the auction, so they were a nice little auction find. So someone was collecting them. All right, so let me take you through them all. First, we have this one here. She's got roses on her hat. But if you put her straight, it's almost like, you know, her head's tilted. She's got it turned the other way. Right there, and her cologne is Little Kate. Bird of Paradise. That's what her cologne is. So that's something. Okay, then we have this one here. She's rather different. And hers is, oops, let me turn it around here. Do, 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 do. Pretty Girl Pink Ochre Cologne. Ha. Huh. All right, and you can hear there's still liquid in it. <laughs> we opened some of these up to smell, and I was like, "Whoa, okay, still holds its smell, believe it or not, after all these years." All right, then this one here is kind of like a candle. It just says Avon number two on it. Probably one of the older ones out of that. But isn't that a nice? Kind of looks like a genie bottle. Beautiful that is. Very nice. Elegant looking. Okay, then we have this one there, right there with all the stars. Uh, let me get her. Excuse me. All right. Look at her with all the stars. Oh, and it says just cologne on it. It says Avon 73. Okay, it doesn't have the name, so... These are probably some of the older ones by not having that. Okay, then we get this pink one here. Look at that. All kind of smiles there. Beautiful. Beautiful. Nice pink. Okay, and this one says Pretty Girl Pink. Somewhere Cologne. Somewhere, somewhere cologne. Okay, I had to turn it around. I didn't think I was reading that right, but that's what it is. Somewhere cologne. Wow, never heard of that name before, but hey, it's there. All right, let me get that one there. That one, when I first looked at it, I says, oh, this goes on a man's, because it looks like a fireman's hat, but it really wasn't. It's <laughs> one of those hats that I guess had an animal or something on it. I don't know. It looks, top of it looks like a fireman's hat. But it's a lady. Okay. And she has fashion figurine unforgettable cologne. Oh, gay 90s. Okay, now gay today means something else. So you know this is an old bottle. Because it says Gay 90s. Let me see if I can get you to see that right. See how it says that? Unforgettable cologne. So this is definitely different. All right. All right, then we have this blue one here. Holding some flowers in a basket and everything. 
All right, and she has somewhere cologne in her too. Little girl blue, somewhere's cologne. Oh, this one's almost all out. Not too much of anything in that. Okay, then we've got this purple one. Well, that's really different. She's just purple, holding her handbag. Been in the sun too much. It says, Roaring Twenties. Unforgettable Cologne. And you can see, there's still cologne in it. Okay, so unforgettable colognes must have come in a whole bunch of collection dolls. All right, and we have this beautiful yellow one here, holding a basket of flowers, beautiful skirt, and let's see what she says. Cody Lion, Cody Lion cologne. Hmm. Why don't you decide how to pronounce that? There you go. You can hear she still has some in her. All right, then we got this one here. Definitely different. And you can hear she has some. And she's somewhere cologne again. Huh, they must have had a whole collection of them. Somewhere cologne came in all different, all for the girl. And then we have this one that's velvet, has no top, still has plenty in there. And it is Moonwind Cologne, Skate Watts, Moonlit, Moonwind Cologne. Huh, but it's kind of a velvet velvet feel. So I have no top for her, but I do have an extra top to another one. <laughs> All right. So I hope you've enjoyed my bringing this to you. Be sure to sub me, join me as a friend, and we'll bring you some more of whatever we find. This was an auction find. All right. Bye-bye now.